This crew are playing a waiting game. They've been stuck on board the Malavia 7 at Aberdeen Harbour for more than a year. The ship was detained last June after it emerged the men hadn't been paid and concern is now growing for their families back home. Tomorrow is my wife's birthday, so I'm going to miss even that. But then she says, don't worry, everything will be okay. Tomorrow may be some good news, that may be her birthday gift, that is what she said. Yes, very difficult. <laughs> My daughter keeps asking. My daughter keeps asking every now and then, when is Papa coming back? It's very difficult for my wife to manage. It's been very difficult. The International Transport Workers Federation estimates the crew are now owed more than six hundred thousand pounds. They believe that the only way they'll get their unpaid wages is if the ship is sold. So hopefully. The judge will listen tomorrow to your side of it. The workers hope permission will be granted to sell the ship in court. The company which owns it, Gall Offshore, is now in liquidation. Gull Offshore have uh, appeared and disappeared, appeared and disappeared, and they're playing with the legal system. And while that's all very well, the horrific circumstances that that is inflicting on the crew has become unacceptable. Community groups have rallied round to keep spirits on board afloat. The crew have seen the sights and taken in the culture, but they don't want to be here. The tragedy lies back home. They've went through such a lot. Uh, we've had many people breaking down, and uh, I've been fortunate to be there for them. But it's been a, it's been a trial for them, some, some mentally and some physically. No one from Gaul Offshore responded to requests for comment. The crew's fortunes now lie in the hands of the court. Rebecca Curran, Reporting Scotland, Aberdeen.